is up guys it's Kevin back in with a quick new video just showing you guys what I've been doing and what I've been working on now this car that I'm about to show you I picked it up for 300 bucks it's an 01 Honda Civic EX uh, of course it has the VTEC motor automatic transmission um, I found it and they had it posted for five and I was like oh man this has got to have some sort of you know big issue with it but um, I emailed the guy because he didn't have a phone number on the post on Craigslist and usually when they don't have a phone number it's more, more likely a scam but I, I sent him an email he messaged me back probably within like 10 minutes and I went down to look at it <clears throat> this is it um, now somebody did try to do some Bondo work here and I just it was a straight Bondo Bondo color and I just blacked it out it makes it look a little bit better uh, other than that there's no huge dents in the car the paint's in okay condition. The tires are actually really good. Now it does run and drive, has a couple issues. Somebody bypassed the um, the AC compressor on it, so I gotta get a belt. And it doesn't have Freon in it, so I got some Freon. I need to charge up the AC and all that. Um, lower control arm bushing on the passenger side makes a little bit of noise. What else? What else? Oh, it's got a check engine light for an O2 sensor. But this thing runs and drives good, and I vacuumed it out. The interior is actually in pretty good condition. It's not really beat up that bad or anything. Now, it did have a double din radio in here with a DVD player. It was like seven inches, and I took that out because I want to put it in my truck. Um, so I put this in here. This is the one actually out of my truck. It still works and all that, but you know, it's whatever. It is super hot here in Georgia today. So that's the reason, that's one of the only reasons that I'm gonna fix the AC on this thing because it's super hot outside. Now, the best thing about this car, if you can see here, let me start it up. Like I said, runs and drives great. The best thing about this car is it only has 143,000 miles. And that is incredible for a 2001. Um, you know, for the for these Civics, that's basically breaking it in. These things don't usually have big issues. They start having transmission issues around 200,000 miles, overheating around the same time. But with 143, and I only paid 300 bucks for it, really, really can't complain. Um, but like I said, the, the AC is gonna be a big deal that I need to get fixed. Uh, let me show you the, the engine. It's super bright outside, so I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to see it very good. But here's the engine. It doesn't have any leaks or anything like that, um, other than the check engine light for the O2. I don't see, you know, there's no tick and no knock, and it doesn't smoke or anything like that. And of course, this is a 1.7 liter uh, VTEC engine. Not a huge fan of these, but they are good motors as long as you. Uh, take care of them do the maintenance and all that but tell me what you guys think i mean for a 300 dollars car um can you really ask for anything other than this and i'm really really lucky um that's one thing i do have to say i'm really lucky uh when it comes to this of course it is a lot about just checking and checking and checking especially if you're doing this as a living you gotta look and look and look and, and sit, uh, like always be on it looking for new deals and uh but it does have it does have a lot of luck to do with it when when you find stuff like this and yeah that's pretty much it guys let me know what you think of the car and uh, I want to thank everybody for liking subscribing leave a comment down below if you have any questions hit me up on Facebook I'll talk to you guys later.